Well, hello everyone. Once again, I'm here with my new brother, Ricky Fayant. And Ricky uh, had a terrible accident. It was in January. What date was it in January? January 26th. January 26th. Your car left the road, you left the car, the car rolled over, and you miraculously survived. But it has left you in a state of being a quadriplegic. But Ricky, on the 13th of February, when I came to your room, you recommitted your life to Jesus Christ. You renounced all of your sin, you believed on Christ and received his spirit into you, and today we are doing something, I've never done this before, is to come to someone and say, to reaffirm that baptismal vow, today we are doing that here. And I'm going to use this basin because he cannot move from his, from his neck down, but he wants to confess Christ. So based on this, Ricky, I'm asking you this question. Have you believed on Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior? I have. Have you received his spirit into your life? Yes. He's living in you now? Yes. Have you renounced the devil and all his works? I have. <laughs> and, and has his blood cleansed you and made you clean? It has. Amen. Amen. And you're going to live from him for him from this day forward? I will. Then based on the confession of your faith, and according to the scripture, we in Colossians 2.12, we are buried with him in baptism, that means the old Ricky, when this water, I can't put you under the water, but I'm going to put the water over you, which symbolizes this old Ricky is gone. He's done. You were buried with him in baptism, in which you were also raised with him through your faith. You have the resurrection power of Jesus Christ in your body. And he who raised him from the dead is going to raise Ricky from when your body one day breathes its last breath. You won't be dead. Your body will be, but your spirit will live. Amen? Amen. And that's the message we want everybody to know. So I'm going to put this bed forward the best I can here. Oops. Okay. And Ricky, upon the confession of your faith, as Jesus Christ is your Lord and Savior, just if you tip your head forward now as much as you can, yeah. I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. The Lord Jesus Christ has saved you and he is coming to resurrect you. I baptize you in his name and even now the power of Jesus Christ renew you and give you newness of life in Jesus Christ. Amen, 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 amen. Hallelujah. It's Palm Sunday today and the angels are rejoicing in heaven, Ricky. Hallelujah. 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 You are born again. You have the Spirit of Christ in you. And you may not be able to move from here down, but I'll tell you, on the Spirit, you are alive. You have the life of Jesus in you. And on the confession of your faith, the first thing I want to do with you is also remember the Lord's death and resurrection. Let us go to the Scripture. And Jesus, on the just before he was he was crucified. The last meal, he said this at that meal. He received, Paul said, I received from the Lord what I passed to you. The Lord Jesus, on the night he was betrayed, he took bread. And when he given thanks, he broke and said, This is my body, which is for you. Do this in remembrance of me. And so, Ricky Allen, Fayette, on the confession of your faith in Jesus Christ, you're not only baptized, but now receive this bread as the symbol of the remembrance of his body that was broken for you and me. We will eat it together. Thank you, Jesus. In the same way now, in the same way, it says this. After supper, he took the cup, saying, this cup is the new covenant of my blood. Do this whenever you drink it in remembrance of me. For every time you eat this bread and drink this cup, you are proclaiming the Lord's death until he comes. Ricky, we will drink this together in remembrance of the shed blood of Jesus that was shed for you and me. Thank you, Jesus. 
shed blood of Jesus for you, Ricky. You shed blood of Jesus for me. Praise be to God. Amen. 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 I can see the joy of the Lord in your face. <laughs> Is there anything you want to tell the people who watch this video? Anything you want to tell your family, your friends, the people who watch this? I am rejoiced and reborn. Amen. 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 God bless you. And maybe somebody watching this, God is speaking to you. And you want to also renounce your sin and your sickness and your diseases and your evil and say, I believe on Jesus. You can do that just like Ricky did. And you can receive the fullness of Jesus' spirit into your body and have, more, have eternal life. God bless you. Thanks for watching.